He hello You were there Ixul Panax Brekal we met Is that a a man It doesn't look human Have we have we met before We will we are meeting now. Venari Abnaxus et al. I am Abnaxus of the Venar. Oh, uh, hi, I'm Zoe of, um, the humans. Who's that? He will be Ular Pala, chief of the Ular. Those who remained, children of the Purple Mountains. Okay, this is a dream, right? It was. You dreamed of things else when. Of Abnaxus who was, and who will soon have passed beyond the veil and into the great forgetfulness. In the dream, I will speak of the time that has flowed, and the time that will still flow. But Outside the dream, I was like a petrified tree in the middle of a river, frozen in this moment, while time parts around me. I think he said his name is Abnaxus. So why am I having this dream? You were needed. Achik aksik nabe ajna achik aksik. The first dreamer needs you. The first dreamer? How did he get over there so quickly? There's some sort of doorway into the mountain. This one is also sick. This one is dying. Lux Kamel. What does that mean? This one's name is Lux. This one is the first dreamer. This one is like you, like your sister, like those who did dream and shaped reality. I can't tell if it's a boy or a girl. But she, or he, is beautiful. Another dreamer? Wait, that, that wasn't real. That was... that was just another dream. Yes. And also much more. We needed you to come. You came. You will come here to help Lux. Everything depends on this. Everything that was is, and will be. If this one ends, everything ends. All of time. Someone... Someone else told me the same thing. What does it mean? This one is the first dreamer. This one dreams. And the dream is the universe. When the dream ends... W what's happening? Well where are you going? Hey! Hey, come back! Tell me what's going on! <gasps> Zoe? Zoe, are you okay? Oh, yeah, I'm okay. I'm fine. I, oh, I was just dreaming. You were crying out in your sleep. Nightmare. Do you want to talk about it? Uh, yes, it was, and uh, no, I don't. 
Uh, what time is it? Time for me to leave and for you to start getting ready for your doctor's appointment. Oh, I want to sleep. Yeah, well, too bad. See you later? Uh, uh, sure. I'll stop by the office when I'm done. Okay. Love you. Mm, me too. Citizen, halt. Where are you going? Why? Answer the question or you will be detained. I have an appointment. The streets are unsafe. Return to your home or business to conduct your appointment remotely. I'm seeing my doctor. What is the name and business location of your doctor? As far as I know, the Eye has no right to interrogate me. Not unless they arrest me first. They have no right to ask for that information, but if I resist, they might put me on a watch list. Or worse. Dr. Roman Zelenka. His office is in Sasadri Tower. You are Zoe Maya Castillo, a resident of Sonnenschein Plaza Terraces by OCG. Are you asking me a question? Stay off the streets, Miss Castillo. It's for your own protection. Sure it is. Proceed. Crowbar is here to help you find your way in Propath. Move along. Nothing to see here. I wasn't sure you'd make it today. What with the Panzer Pandu out in force? Say hello to our new robot overlords. It was touch and go. Were you waiting for me? I don't do apologies. Okay. When you bumped into me outside the collective, I was confrontational. I didn't mean to be. You don't do apologies, Nela. You're right, so shut up and accept it. 
Accepted. So why were you confrontational? Paranoia, Zozo. I'm just on edge with this party business. No big deal. By party business, she probably means the Marxists. And it's really none of my business. Party business? Oh, she must mean the Marxists. I'm curious to know what's got her so on edge. What's going on? <sighs> Manifesto starting to come apart at the seams. Too many conflicts of interests. Ribas is having a tough time keeping everyone in line. There's no consensus about strategy, about what to do to get people to open their eyes and see what's really going on in this city. Some want to keep doing what we have been doing. Peaceful protests, debate, passing out pamphlets. Others want to take more radical action. Like what? It's politics, Zozo. You know how it is. The hardest part is agreeing on the common agenda. I'm not sure it matters. We're last in the polls and it'll take a miracle to change that. But anyway, you were asking me about Hannah Roth. I'm looking for her. Why? Oh, it's complicated. Queenie, you know, the babka on the boat down Sure, the... everyone knows her. Queenie asked me to look for Hannah, to find out if she's okay or not okay, I guess. Why the hell would she be asking you? Campaign business. I'm trying to get her to officially support Leia Uminska. Ah, it's all starting to make sense. Do you know Hannah? She runs errands for merchants in Propast, does odd jobs for anyone willing to pay. She's helped me out a few times, deliveries mostly, and also... Well, that's how I know Hannah. But I don't know where she lives. I don't know who her friends are, I don't know how to get hold of her. So, why...? She runs a gang, all homeless girls, the Dragonflies. They operate out of the underground here in Propast. They do odd jobs, legit jobs, but also... other jobs. Like crime? Like crime, Zozo. Pickpocketing, fencing, smuggling, selling unlicensed dreams. Drugs. Keep an eye out for the dragonfly symbol, and the girl with short, pink hair and piercings. That'll be Hannah. Oh, I appreciate it, Nella. I'm sorry about getting involved in your affairs last week. Don't worry about it. You still haven't tried the pork sausages. The last batch was a bit... iffy. There were complaints and also food poisoning, but I just received a new delivery and they smell much better this time around. Right. Uh, some other time, maybe. I hope you find Hannah. The eye in the sky watches so you don't have to. Help us help you. Nella, street Stay chef, inside. Marxist, spark and plug, and friend of mine. I do love her, in smaller doses. How are things between you and Reza? They're... okay. Just okay. Rocky. And... how do you feel about that? Things are rougher than they were. It's not like we fight every day, but it's... tense. We're circling each other. Nothing's changed. I love Reza. We're having a tough time, but it's worth fighting for, right? I feel good. I feel fine. I try not to think too much about it. Listen to your own feelings. Be aware of them. I will. In our last session... Last week. Uh, last week, uh, you said you want to remember. Right. About what happened before the coma. Yeah. Is that still the case? I've thought about it, and no. I don't want to spend any more time ruminating on the past. It's time to move on. I haven't changed my mind. I need to go back before I can move forward. I want to remember. Yep. Okay. Good. I think it's right of you to focus on remembering. I believe it will help you... wake up. W wake up? W what do you mean? I, I am awake. Oh, wait, sorry, I I'm getting a call. Do you need to take it? Uh, it's, it's just Baruti, my campaign manager. I'm, I'm sure it can wait. Sorry about that. Where were we? D what did you mean by waking up? Are you sleeping well? 
Uh, no, not really, no. And why is that? I, I dream. A lot. They're very vivid dreams. Lucid. Not like... like normal dreams at all. Do you remember these dreams? I think my dreams are important. If I talk about them, maybe Roman can help me figure them out. I'm not sure I want to share my dreams with Roman. They feel important, but private. I'll figure them out on my own. I... I don't remember the details. Didn't you just tell me they were lucid dreams? I... I guess, yeah, but... But I, I don't remember any specific details, only fragments, and, and they're gone as soon as I wake. Dreams are never just dreams. They can be mirrors, reflecting our darkest fears and deepest desires. They can provide us with clues to who we are. They can... stir memories. But let's leave that for next week. Our time is up. Today was another step forward, Zoe. Regardless of what you do or do not remember, I want you to think about what I said. About working on your memories. About remembering. You really should write down your dreams, you know. It will help you remember. I should head out, leave you to your note-taking. Always taking notes, that's me. See you next week, Zoe. Same time, same place. You betcha. I thought we agreed you wouldn't show up at my office. I am not comfortable with this. She just left, by the way. Hey, you probably passed her on the way in. She would have seen you. I'm a ghost, Dr. Zelenka. People do not see me unless I let them. What have you learned? Well, she wants to remember. And will she? I don't know. Eventually, probably. You know what to do if she does. You've made that very clear. What else would you like to tell me today? She's not sleeping well. It's her dreams. She used the words vivid and lucid. Of what she wouldn't say. I get the feeling she's not being forthcoming. She lies to you. No more uh, uh, omitting the truth. We pay you a great deal of money to make sure Ms. Castillo has no secrets. I'll, I'll push. Next time. In your professional opinion, is she starting to remember? I don't think so. Not yet. That is all. Thank you, Doctor. Uh, how much longer will I need to do this? Without us, you would have nothing. Do you not want it to continue? Uh, I... Until she remembers. Until then. And if that never happens? Then we terminate. Good day to you, Dr. Zelenka. I just paid the doctor a visit. He tells me she has her mindset on remembering what occurred last year. Yes, Zelenka does believe she will remember in time. There's another thing we just learned. She has vivid dreams, as you said she would. She would not tell the doctor anything about her dreams. She may be keeping secrets from him. If this is the case, he may be outlasting his usefulness. Sehr gut, Fräulein. I will contact you immediately if I hear anything else. I have ears in all places. The moment she remembers, we will know. Sorry, I was with my therapist when you called earlier. Hey, Sissy. Uh, no worries. Can we meet? I'm not working today, so absolutely. Should I come by the campaign office? Let's meet somewhere else. I'm by the river, right next to the memorial fountain in Prista Viste. Uh, uh, yeah? Sh sure. W when? Now? Uh, whenever you're available. I'll be there. All right. Uh, uh, see you soon. Ready, partner? Where are you off to today? It was a pleasure serving you this fine day, miss. Please, do not question.
Thanks for coming, Sissi. Of course. Well, what's up? Last week, when you asked me about Constantine Wolf, I told you I was looking into Bukamba Mesa's accounts. I also remember telling you to be careful. I was. I am. It, it's just... I was hoping to find evidence of Wolf taking corporate payoffs. And? I found something. A... Uh, discrepancy. Pointing to our campaign. To unity. To Lea Uminska. What sort of discrepancy? This is why I wanted to meet you. Outside. I don't know if they have the office under surveillance, if they're monitoring my iris or my wire access. Seriously? What's going on? I don't know yet. But I need to find out. My contact at Bokamba Mesa came across transactions between the Syndicate and Unity. There's money being funneled into our campaign from places money shouldn't be coming from. Corporate money. It could be just a... A, a misunderstanding. There might be a good explanation for it, but it could also be... serious. It could be serious. So I need to dig deeper. The trouble is, I don't know if they're watching me. I, I can't risk it. I wouldn't be asking if it wasn't important, Sissi. Look, if Leo Uminska is taking bribes, or worse, I want to know. So, what is it you need me to do? Access Unity servers and download the data. How exactly am I going to do that? Just log in with my iris and wire ID? The eye would be onto you in minutes, Sissy. No. You'll need a rogue data sniffer and a government-grade black mask protocol. And you'll need to use multiple accounts and access points to transfer all the data. Stay logged in for too long in one location. They could pin you down. Look, I completely understand if you say no. It is illegal, and it can get us both into a lot of trouble. I understand why this is important, but I'm worried about the repercussions. I got in trouble the last time I tried to uncover a corporate conspiracy. I don't want to end up in another syndicate interrogation room. I don't have all the information yet. Where did Baruti learn about this? Why was he digging into the campaign finances? I do have reservations, but I don't want to work for a crooked campaign. If something's going on, we need to find out. I don't have all the inf- How did you come across this information? My contact at Wakamba Mesa has access to syndicate data streams. I asked him to keep an eye out for certain keywords and names. It's a bit ironic in hindsight, but I've been looking for any piece of dirt I could find on Constantine Wolf and European Dawn. Last week, my contact got in touch. He'd found something odd. Large donations to a political non-profit in Europolis. I told him to put a trace on it. Yesterday, he messaged me again to tell me he was out. He discovered a link, but it wasn't what any of us expected. There were records of a series of encrypted transactions between the Syndicate and Unity. And Uminska. My contact was worried about the implications. He wanted nothing to do with it, which is understandable. He did provide me with enough information to get started. Network addresses, logins. If we can grab the data, I can analyze it, find the evidence I need to, to, to do whatever comes next. Hopefully, evidence of no wrongdoing. Maybe someone's trying to falsely implicate unity. It wouldn't be the first time. I can't believe Uminska would take corporate payoffs. I mean, not her. I trusted her. Completely. I do have reservations, but I don't want to... I'll do it. Where do I begin? Before he jumped ship, my contact made an anonymous drop with all the information we need. I can't risk transmitting it to you, even locally, in case they're monitoring my iris. I've put everything on this crypto coin. Wire addresses, shadow accounts. Use this to transfer the data back to me after you're done. Now. Before you get started, you'll need a rogue data sniffer and a black mask protocol. You know Mira? At the Pandemonium? They're located in the bricks. She trades in grey market merchandise. Mira. Pandemonium. While you're acquiring the data, I'll go to the office to join a remote campaign meeting. 
If they're somehow alerted to the intrusion, I'll have an alibi. We'll have time to pull out and cover our tracks. Cover our tracks? Oh, Jesus, this is really happening. <laughs> it's happening. I'll contact you later and let you know where to meet me. I don't know how long it'll take, but I'll do my best. Adbots are all over the place. Sometimes I think they target me specifically just to fuck with me. A dragonfly. That girl must be one of Hannah's gangs. Hey! Hey! Wait, I just want to talk to you. It's inactive, I think. Weird. The vent that girl disappeared through is connected to one of those, um, mystery... Those towers are all over Propast. Are there vents below all of them? Maybe Crowboy can give me a layout of all the towers in Propast. The girl used the hatch to go underground. There's a notch on the side. An interactive tourist map of Propast. Super and you useful. Give you, directions, miss. you just tell me where you want to go today. It would really help to have an overview of all those ventilation towers or whatever they are. Do you have a map of the vent towers in Propast? Say what now? You know, the striped towers with the steam coming out of them. They're all over the place. Hold your horses, cowgirl. Your request is being processed. Well, shucks, you're talking about the WPG. The W what now? The old wireless power grid, WPG. They shut that down years ago. The towers are still up, but they're inactive. So why is there smoke coming out of them? Oh, the steam's no mystery. That's just a side effect of opening a hole into the old Propast underground. If I were you, I'd be more curious about the towers that don't have steam coming out of them. Okay. Can you send me a map of Propast with all the, uh, the WPG towers? Open a connection to Crowboy, partner. One tourist map of Propast coming right up. Y'all come back any time now, you hear? Do not question me. You know, you don't have to stop here. I don't have anything to... You're making a smart decision. That's it. Corporate sponsored ad block. They were illegal in Casablanca. Oh, hi there. I miss so Casablanca. You've got to be fucking kidding me. How do you feel about your current insurance plan? I've warned you time and again not to. On a scale from 0 to 10, how satisfied are you with your insurance premium? Activate parameter defenses. You answered zero. I'm going to go ahead and offer you an incredibly good deal on workplace insurance for the low, low, low price of twenty. Activate defenses. Fry that mother chewing rust bucket. Thank you for accepting this very generous offer for a lifetime workplace insurance package. Please repeat your full name to digitally sign the agreement with Original Consumer Goods and to begin enjoying your new insurance. Activate defenses now. Activate. Activate. Thank you for digitally signing your new lifetime insurance package. All sales are final and there are no refunds. Power on! Fly the fucker! Activate! 
Thank you, sir and or madam, and have a wonderful afternoon. Well, shitting shit. It's unsafe. Avoid crowds.